guys welcome back to my channel says Gabriella thank you guys so much for coming back before we get started I do want to mention again 54% of you guys who are watching me are not subscribed please hit that subscribe button and become part of this family my goal this year is to reach a thousand subscribers please help me reach a thousand subscribers it would mean the world to me if you guys help me reach my goal and also if you guys um, haven't checked out my dad's channel I will leave the link right here so you guys can go check out his channel anyways guys in today's video as you guys can tell by the title we are gonna be reacting well I'm gonna be reacting to my high school pictures slash college pictures oh my god I am so excited because I am about to be 25 next month if you guys don't know my birthday my birthday is on June 26 mark your calendars um and gosh I've changed so much over the years and dang I just feel like my style has been really cute really ugly really cute really ugly I've changed a lot I've been really skinny I've gained weight and then lost weight and my it's just so weird how your body changes over the years and I don't know I'm so excited to go on my computer and show you guys the pictures that I hope to show you guys I hope you guys are ready okay let me log into my computer I'm gonna be using my laptop I'm gonna um, put the pictures right here that's why I'm trying to leave a lot of space so I can put the picture right there so you guys can see what pictures I'm reacting to give me one second if you guys are doing good I know this quarantena has been making everybody just go a little crazy I don't know why but this has been like this has been the most emotional period cycle I've had in such a while like I've been crying non-stop like even though nobody has seen me cry in my house I just cry like in my room like at night like I just start to think about things and then I just like start to cry and on my last video like you guys can totally tell that I was about to cry again I don't know why guys I'm just such an emotional person so please bear with me because like I said this has been a very emotional Okay, so I'm gonna show you this first picture. This picture is this was senior year. So I have long hair. I do have an ombre. I was really skinny, guys. I was very, very skinny. I had braces. I was like 90 pounds. I was 17 years old when I took this picture. Wow, such a long time. Another picture of me in high school. I was 17. This was the last month of our senior year so this picture right here this was junior year yeah i took this picture junior year i was 16 years old i look i was so petite so little i used to love over curling my hair like my hair was like literally their sister would call me goldilocks because my hair was always like super tight curled and i had an ombre i think because of the color too but mostly because of how my hair was curled about to be a sophomore this was right after freshman year i went to church camp and i was i made my own costume guys it was in one of the camps if you guys are part of the crew shout out to y'all because the crew was fun those were like the best days oh my god this was an eighth grade picture that somebody took of me and this was like you know eighth eighth grade awkward phase i was just a little chubby i was chubsters there because you know like you're barely like gonna stretch out and grow i didn't get as tall as i wanted to but <sighs> you know what if i could be taller i would just a little bit but I'm fun size this is junior year guys I was during if this was during soccer season oh my god guys I don't think they're subscribed to my channel this was uh, Gabby and Paula so Paula is my one of my ex's sisters and then Gabby was my best friend I love her she was my twin uh we were both gabby's we were both in soccer we were both 
always chilling. Here's another picture of us. I remember this day where we went to drop off my grandparents in the um, what's it called in the Tufesa, um, and they went with me. It was fun. I remember that day. Picture is me and Gabby. We went to um, La Michoacana. You guys, if you guys went to Tolleson, give this a like or leave an emoji down below because La Michoacana was the spot. This picture, you guys, okay. I had a friend in high school. I'm not gonna say her name. I'm not. But we made plans to go out to go out to dinner. And out. This was like planned out for a couple of days already. And I was really excited because I really wanted to go out like with a friend and go have dinner or whatever. And I remember this guys, I wore that blue shirt. I wore some really cute heels. Um, got ready. This was this was my junior year. Okay, guys, junior year. I got ready and I got so cute. And I waited for hours, guys. For hours, I waited. Next to her, like, dude, I'm ready. Like, when are we going? Like, are you coming? Do you want me to go for you? Like, my mom can take us. Like, I was just waiting, guys. It hit. Maybe like around midnight, I was like, all right, this ain't gonna happen. Like, no me va, ya no me está pelando, you know? So I got stood up, guys, by a friend, um, and she never apologized. We went back to school, and she never said, like, hey, I'm sorry, like, nothing, guys. We just pretended like it didn't happen. And I didn't say anything because I was so embarrassed. Like, I can't believe someone stood me up. Like, I couldn't believe it. So I just, I never spoke about it again until now. This picture is a special picture because this picture is where, it was my first night alone in Flagstaff. I moved to Flagstaff for college and this was the first picture ever taken there with Liane and Susan Kelly. I love them so much. Oh my God, we had so so much fun in Flagstaff and it's so crazy because I was such a baby you know and they really did um they they were really there for me oh so thankful for them because I feel like I would have never had friends the way that I did because of them you know like I don't know it's just hard to explain but VNA Susan Kelly if you know you know <laughs> if you know you know this is a little clip. I'm gonna go ahead and play it for you guys. This is Susan Kelly, and this is um, Alyssa. Alyssa was one of my best friends in Flagstaff. Shout out to you, because we had so much fun, so much fun. Um, you guys, the parties that we would throw, bomb parties. And just to clarify, because I know my dad's gonna watch this, I know my mom's gonna watch this, I never got drunk guys never got drunk in flagstaff i probably got buzzed once or twice but i never got drunk never 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 and they're my witnesses so unless they think i was drunk but i never got drunk <laughs> let me play <laughs> I know guys, we were so cute. This was also in college. This is my freshman year. Um, my sisters. Oh no, we went. We had to do a scavenger hunt, and I had to take pictures in certain places. And this happened to be one of the places. <laughs> but yeah, guys, that was so cute. I love you, Gabby. I love you. I love this shit. This was a selfie mirror I took in college. I look so cute. Like, I'm actually, I miss living at Flagstaff and I miss going to NAU because I just live, I just love, loved having like my own life over there. Like, I didn't live with anybody. I didn't have to report to anybody. <sighs> that was the best that was fun i don't think i could do that again maybe 
when I changed a little bit. I wanted to change my style up a little bit. This was um, still my freshman year of college. No, this was now, I think, my sophomore year? I think this was my sophomore year. I cut my bangs. I cut the bit. I cut them babies. And I'm thinking of doing that again. If you guys think I should have bangs, let me know. Comment down below or or just tell me yes, no, vote. Um, Cause I really want bangs again. Y'all let me know if you think I look good in bangs. Let me find out you think I look cute. Let me find out. This was another picture in my, um, uh, my apartment. And this was when I was wearing, um, yeah, this was when I, when I cut my bangs too. I look so cute, huh? So chic. This is me and Daniel. That's the cute. This is my best friend, guys. Him and Jessica and Jackie. Of course, and Susie Kelly. We were all we were all a crew. We were all best friends, guys. This was me and Rafa and Daniel. We were always eating pizza. First of all, we were always eating pizza. Whereas we were always hanging out. They are my peeps. I messaged Rafa and Daniel today because I miss them so much and I haven't talked to them in a very long time. So I was like, you know what? Let me text them the picture I found of us. Yeah, but we were such babies. Ah, good times. This was me about to study for finals with Jessica she took the picture oh my god we stayed in the library until 4 a.m almost 5 a.m and when we went outside it was freaking snowing and we didn't even have like snow clothes you know but that was such a good a good night I remember I remember that this was me in my apartment thinking I was super cute trying to take a picture of myself and I look cute what can I say? Oh my god, okay, so this video was me when I lived in my apartment and I, I had toilet paper, guys, don't worry. But this was like Snapchat was popping back then and I would always post like funny videos. Um, and if you guys don't remember, then you guys probably didn't think I was funny. So, yeah, let me show you the paper. So you're in the bathroom, but you don't have a job. Does it? Guys, can we relate to that? La cuarentena? That's how everybody is right now. This is a video that I mean about the eyebrows. Eyebrows on fleek. The fuck? This picture was the day that my sisters um, and my cuñado Ciel left me. So after this picture was when I officially stayed alone in Flagstaff. Um, so this was like my goodbye picture that they took. And it's so cute, huh? Like I love this picture so much. Super, super cute. Guys, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a whole bunch of snapshots that I didn't get to um, put in. I do want to say that if you guys were part of my high school experience or part of my college experience, just know that I have a special part in my heart for each and one of you guys. I know I don't speak to everybody still and not everybody speaks to me still because it's a two-way street, but I just want to tell you guys I love you guys. Thank you so much for being part of my important years of my life. and. You guys are all doing great. Some of you guys are already married. Some of you guys already have kids. And I'm so happy and I'm so proud of each and every one of you guys because everybody has their story. And I have no bad feelings for anybody at all. Anybody. I know some people have, we probably, our friendships probably didn't continue. and. I love you guys all and I hope you guys are all doing good. I hope you guys are all succeeding in whichever career you guys decided to do so. And if you guys ever need a friend, if you guys ever need anybody, you guys know that I'm right here.
I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of me reacting to my photos and whatever. If you guys want to see another video like this, please let me know. If you guys have pictures of me or of us, please send them to me. That way I can feature it in my next video if you guys want to see that. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, become part of this family, turn on that notification bell to be notified when I upload the next video. Thank you guys. Bye.